Inquisitor? The Arcanist has arrived? You should see for yourself. Hello there. Well, don't just stand there slack jawed. Let's figure out what you need. You're the magical advisor? You're him. The Inquisitor. I'm Dagna. Arcanist Dagna. It's an honor, Your Worship. Is that it? The hand anchor mark? Reach was pretty too, in a destroy everything sort of way. <laughs> I welcome you to the Inquisition and look forward to your contribution. Me too. I've heard some impossible things. I love impossible things. Those are the best to make, well, possible. I've looked at Herod's devices. Precision is fantastic, but typical, mundane, old thinking. This will now. No disrespect meant to the classical trades, but. You need a new perspective. I've made adjustments. As long as I keep making them, you can craft just about anything. Almost safely. You seemed impressed by the anchor. What does it look like to you? I heard what everyone says what you heard Corypia say. That's a long chain of who said what. To me, it says key. But keys do a lot of things. Open, lock, switch. Some open one thing, some open everything. It sounds like Corypheus made it open. But it looks like you can use it to close. It may be that simple. It sure is pretty. Wish I could see through it. What is it you do exactly? I was born to the forge. That's literal in this midcast. So the hammer and tong, that's like a heartbeat. But you've a man for that already, and a good one. I'm here because of my passion for magic. Magical study, magical theory, magical enchantment, and through it, the manipulation of masterworks. I studied it all with an objective eye. No secrets, no fears. That lets me apply principles like no other. Maybe one other, but I don't have that wonky of a mind, so I still kind of win. You have the ability to make exceptional weapons and armor. Masterworks? There's an art to the forge, as well as enchanting. You need an ear for it. And hands. Eyes, too. Nothing bad to say about Herod on that front. He's, he's wonderful. But there's this little more needed. With the right bits, an edge can be more than an edge. Armor can do more than protect. A hue can be just a bit brighter. In short, smithing can be... more. <laughs> In short. <laughs> What's the story with enchanting? Leary on the heart. In certain rational patterns, it beats like something alive. That's how I see it. So, a mage can make your weapons do things, but with the right runes, the right rarities, your toys become wonders. It's the one thing mages can't do. It drives them mad. Literally. Dwarves are resistant, so it doesn't affect us. Mostly. Another time, Dagon. Of course. Bring me what you want made, and I'll make sure it goes just right. Ready to answer the great mysteries. It'll be wonderful. Where does a dwarf go to study magical theory? Get out. I asked myself that question for years. Turns out, not in Orzmar. I had to start at the circle. I had help, though. A great warden, and I am forever grateful. With that sanction, I visited a half dozen circles. The wonders I've seen. And with an objective eye, I can spot where they overlap. That's a surprise for every teacher. It's a grand tradition, and it works so well with new thinking. You mentioned a Grey Warden who helped you start your studies? Not any Grey Warden. THE Grey Warden. The Hero of Ferelden is a hero in Orzammar, too. It's incredible that someone like the Hero of Ferelden would stop to help the little people. Literally. <laughs> your years of study have paid off. Oh, yes. The mages said I brought a valuable perspective. 
I've even presented my work to the College of Enchanters. I wanted an exchange. The surface could learn about lyrium smithing, and Orzammar would gain knowledge of magic. But now there's no college. And so far as the Shaper is concerned, I'm castless. So you're getting my best work, Inquisitor. Let's make some great stuff. You gave up so much. Left your home. Was it really that amazing? Yes. I left my home and my family, but I knew... I just knew I could be more than a smith. I wish my people weren't stuck in the past, and I regret that my father couldn't imagine another life for me. But I don't regret what I did. The Warden affected you in a special way. Talk to anyone, they'll say the same. It was a dark time. There was one light. He saved us. He saved me. All right, bring it in. You have work to do. Right, sorry. I get carried away when I think of it. Ready when you need me. Mind your stop for things, Inquisitor. You were quick to join the Inquisition. Is there something you want? How could I waste a chance to get close to you? And Corythius, my goodness. And actual physical rifts in the veil. Also, dwarves? We don't dream. So, when mages talk about it, I can only... Well what it would be like. So there's that, and all the things you'll probably find, and what I'll get to make. The rules are different here. Plus, you're paying me a lot. Like, wow, so much. What qualifies you to be an arcanist? I took the title because I'm a magical researcher, philosopher, and master of practical application. And I like it. I can't actually do magic because I'm a dwarf, but that also means no risk of possession safer than a mage. It means that every skill I have, I've learned through reason and understanding. Coming from the Smith cast, I know the value of mastering the craft. Did you know dwarves invented enchanting? Probably. Dagna, show me what you can do. Do you want fire? The first ask is always fire. It's fire, isn't it? Here's how it goes. Bring me the rare stuff for enchanting or masterworks and prep it here, just like normal. Except it's not... It's manipulation of primal forces, and I'll make sure it goes just right. We'll see. Let's see together. I've walked away from too many burning buildings for one lifetime. This place, though, it'll be all right. It's Inquisitor now, isn't it? That'll take some getting used to. Everyone needs time for this transition. Time won't help. Purpose does, and I got a load of it. Everyone just got a big, hard reason to hate Corypheus. And we already did, but we didn't have a name. You're the surprise, not him. We left in a hurry, but you got into your old place. Save anything? Family ammo. It's as stupid as it sounds. It's good to be back at work. How is this place shaping up as a forge? Better than Haven ever could be. Not the way I wanted an upgrade, but ever forward. You've got it all up and running? Your basics, like always. There's space here for... I don't know what. This place was built for something big. It'll be a job to fill it. Any thoughts about our new tenant? You sure she doesn't own the place? Acts like it. No offense. It needed work. And fine work she's done to it. And for you. Don't mind me. Been a lot of change lately. Cheery as sugared flowers she is. I'll be back later. I'll be here. <laughs> 